Hey everybody, this is Stacy uh, with Texas East Kids and I am here with Macy Parsley and we are here giving you your daily dose of gymnastics for the day. So today we're going to talk about uh, bridging up and kicking over. First thing to do a bridge is to do a really great layout. You want to tuck up under your shoulders with your elbows as close as possible. And then pushing on both hands and both feet, go straight up in the air. There we go. Okay, come down, Macy. And let's turn a little bit for the camera. It's very important when you do your bridge that your hands are relatively close together. You want them sort of under your shoulders. Sometimes they get really wide. Super wide. And maybe your hands are sideways. And that's just not good technique for gymnastics. And it's not good for your shoulders. So make sure your fingers are facing your toes. Elbows are straight and under your shoulders. Now, everybody wants to do a flip, and this is the first great flip. You want to start on an elevated surface. Okay, kids, so one important thing to know when you do your bridge and you want to do that kickover or that flip, you have to take your neck and your face and stick it way out so that the chest falling past the palm of the hand helps you get over. One more time, Macy. We'll bridge up first. Just a plain bridge up. And now don't kick yet, but just stick your chest way out. Yes, even your chin like this. And kick that leg. Yes, very good. For just a little more challenge, you can go to a lower surface. So the same thing. Start with your body on top of the surface. Your hands reach down under your shoulders. Take your favorite leg, kick it up, and over. And then, of course, the very last step would be flat on the floor. Pretty layout first. Tuck the hands and knees under. Push. And kick. Uh-oh. Try again. Stick your nose out. <laughs> there she got it. Good job, Maisie. High five. Okay, Marisol, now it's up to you. Show us how we can do this at home as well. Hey guys, this is Marisol from Texas East, and this is Olivia. We were challenged to do a kickover off of the couch, and now with this skill, make sure that you are asking mom and dad to do it, only because it is using the couch, and we wanna make sure that we're being safe and that we're not you know, breaking anything, not breaking a person or some lamps, just kinda depends. So the best way to start with this is again, we have our padded surface. It could be these little tiles, um, a yoga mat. If you're at home and you have a rug, carpet, anything that's just soft for their hands and in case they just fall over and tumble over, they're not landing on hardwood floors. So she's gonna start up here with um, sitting on the couch. Actually sit down. We wanna sit down. She's gonna bring her feet on top and she's gonna scoot in, lay down. We're gonna go back to that beautiful bridge that we learn with our fingertips under our shoulders, elbows in, belly flat, and we're gonna bridge up. Since it is a little bit tall, I'm gonna help her by pushing up her hips from here. She's already pressing her shoulders open, which is what we're looking for in a kickover. She'll then kick over, arms and ears. Okay, now as she's kicking over, we wanna make sure that we're sustaining her back and her shoulder so that it's she's supported. Yeah. If she was a beginner, I would get my shoulder more underneath her holding her shoulders and then bumping her with my elbow when she kicks over, ready to go, kick. Just like that. So it helps her get over and it's safer. And now that I feel like it's getting easier, I'll remove a couch cushion. So it's a little bit lower and it's kind of making the ground. And same thing, bridging up, pushing from our belly button against the ground with our hands. Ready, one, two, three, pop. And then again here, I can either hold the hips if she's been doing them. If not, I'll go back to getting really in there for her. Kick. Just like that. You can move it onto the ground. Come right down. Again, just reinforcing being safe and making sure that we have a soft place for her to do this. Push up. And here, you wanna make sure she's pressing the shoulders open. And then she can kick over just like that. And that's her daily dose with Texas East. <laughs> <laughs> 